Hey guys, Apro here and today I'm going to show how to jailbreak our iPhone 3GS with Adasian and Red Snow jailbreaks and I'm going to start. So first what we have to do to download the Red Snow and Adasian programs. Here it is, so Adasian method, it's very easy. Uh, here you can see, uh, run as administrator, yes, and now connect your iPhone to the computer. And press jailbreak. When process will stop there, you have to uh, unlock your iPhone, press unlock. Okay, press your code then. And uh, in, this, in the safe slot will be the evasion icon. You have to press on that icon and the jailbreak will continue. Uh, you can see the evasion icon, it looks like this. And this is the evasion jewelry. It's really easy. And I recommend you to try this. Uh, but red snow jailbreaks are very hard and I'm going to show how to do this. So, your iPhone is connected to the computer. Then uh, press red snow. Run this administrator. Yes. And there, you, and there you can see all our information about iPhone, Apple iPhone 3GS, 6.1, uh, new brand, and this is modern firmware. You can change this with iPad baseband, I'm going to talk about it later. So first, I have to go extras, select IPSV, and select my firmware. Uh, this Red Snow program is capable with 6.0, but you can load newer programs which is capable uh, like 6.1, uh, 6.1.2.3 6 and with any other. I'm going to show how to do this with 6.0. We asked to this, and this is a message. Uh, my model is newer or older. If your mo model is newer, you can't install boot logo. But if you, your model is older, you can't install. So check your model is newer or older. And I'm going to show how to do this. So first you enter in settings, general, about, and then in, on the serial number you see this three digits. 9, 4 and 7. This is manufactured year and week. So this is 2009 and 47 week. So my model is newer. I can see that uh, units made uh, on 2009 week 44 or later usually have fixed bottom. But before week 40, we usually have older. Between weeks 40 and 45, results worry. So, my is 47 and my bottom is new, so I don't want to install boot logos and I press yes. But if you, your model is older, you press no. But I have to press yes. So, I back, uh, press jailbreak, and we are preparing jailbreak data, patching journals. Uh, so and there is most important thing you have to you have to press this install Cydia because it's a main program. Uh, what you can to do with Cydia I can show. Now you can see this is iPhone 3GS. It's really not fake uh, iPhone 16 GB 3GS and I can show in the settings. Apple iPhone 3GS, I not named that, it's not a fake. 
and how you can see it looks like iOS 7. This is mod from CDA which I downloaded and uh, placed into Winterboard and this is them and it looks pretty awesome. How you can see this is green them and iPhone looks uh, very nice. I like this. So that's why I jailbreak my iPhone. I can play many games like Grand Theft Auto 3, Vice City, FIFA 30 and I can download it, fr it free with some apps downloaded from Cydia. So, uh, jailbreaker iPhone, I recommend it for you. And then, and then uh, you have to, uh, if you have to unlock your iPhone, locked your iPhone, you have to press install iPad baseband because you will unlock your iPhone with free and install new modem firmware. But this is a no. If your iPhone is 2011 and week 34 or later, you can install because this is a newer models and your iPhone will be just bricked and you can't restore your GPS or Bluetooth Wi-Fi uh, connection so don't try this and do, don't do this but if your device is older uh, like mine, mine is 2009 uh, week 47 I can press yes and never mind so when I press next I have to enter into the DFU mode how to do this? I I'll put the link into the video description and that's all. When you put your device into the DFU mode, then you press next and the program will do everything for you. So thank you for watching. Uh, that was iPro help <laughs> here. Uh, if you can subscribe, like this video and goodbye. Enjoy this. See you next time.